And here we go. Hi there. Boy, did I pick a sunny day to come out to the park to do a video. Whoa, it's summery. It's going to be like 86 today. Foo. So I'm doing this in the morning while it's still kind of like in the low 70s. And you're all waiting to see some CDs that I've got, haven't you? Yes, I know. So let us begin. You might remember this one. This is a, a Joe Jackson one that I ordered on eBay. And when I opened it up, you know, like with the opening grand reveal, it turned out to be the wrong one that they sent. <laughs> this is the one I should have gotten. Yes, the two CD, and it's titled the same, and even on the eBay ad, it had this picture. But they sent me that one. So, like, ah. So, that one's going away. This is the keeper. This is the one I ordered. Now I'm happy. There we go. What else did I get? Oh my gosh, the knack. The knack. Hello. <laughs> Oh wow, this is like their first three albums on two CDs. Comes from Switzerland, of all things. And uh, little girls don't understand in the round trip, they're hard to get on CDs. So like, this was like, oh, thank you. I get them at a lower price and get, get them all at once. And now I can say I have a complete run of all the Knack's studio albums. So there you go. Got some The Knack. Very good. All right. Also, you know when you watch other people's streams and videos, you get ideas. Well, Steve and Schnee did a video on Culture Club not too long ago. And there it is. It's in there somewhere. Eh. I hope it's showing up. I can't see myself in the, in the glare. But okay. Got a Greatest Hits of Culture Club. Mm. And remember, don't you dare copy it, kids. Don't you dare. But that's what I've got recently that's good stuff. Now, how would you like to see the bad stuff? Because when I go to put my trash out in the dumpster, I always kind of peek in because you never know what you might find. And somebody threw some CDs out. Some people, you know, so like, yeah, I grabbed them. And I will show them to you now. Look, it's Alan Jackson. Don't rock the jukebox. For all you country lovers and boogie woogie country whatever. Alan Jackson, don't rock the jukebox. From the trash. Also from the trash. Kid Rock. You seeing this okay? Yeah. A Kid Rock album. Uh yeah, me neither. <laughs> also have some John Michael Montgomery. Who's that? I never heard of him. Well, judging from the pictures, I guess he's a country guy. So, I don't know. I don't know. Got some rock classics? Ooh. Look at these fine selections. Yes! Gee, doesn't it make your ears water? Well, mine would water if I needed some of these tracks, but no, I got all these songs in one way or another, so. Eh, so much for rock classics, but here's the piece of the resistance. Four CD set of hits of the 80s. And you might say, ooh, that's good, but yeah, they're, come back over here, they're performed by Countdown. <laughs> Countdown with four CDs. Yeah, look at that. Yeah, look at that. But, you know, like Countdown, they do a, a fair imitation of the songs on here, such as... Uh, Oh, we've got to, what's love got to do with it? And Uptown Girl and and Mooney Mooney and Living on a Prayer. Well, the, the songs aren't bad, really. I, I played a little bit of it, but it's 
kind of funny when they try to imitate the singers. So when they do, girls just don't want to have. <laughs> uh. So when they do, girls just want to have fun and they try to imitate Cindy Lauper. It's kind of funny. So it's good for a laugh, but would I keep this? No. So anyway, that is what I found recently. And I hope you enjoyed this really sunny video because I can't even see myself over there. But So I hope you can. And uh, come on back and we'll see what I've found in the next video. Okay? Goodbye.